Sister Pume Zangaleka tested positive on the 17th of June. Three days later, she was fighting for her life in hospital. She is now on a crusade, raising awareness about the virus. It's better to, to, to protect than at the end, you end up dying. It's not nice to take the COVID here, even if you take it from the street and you take it to your family, and your family dies. Like the old people, the young ones, are the, the ones that are getting out, but they take the COVID and take it to their homes, to their old people. We are trying to say to the Doranginza staff, they must spread the gospel, not here at Doranginza, outside the communities of Port Elizabeth. Sister Ngaleka and Dr. Jeline Kotze conduct COVID-19 testing for staff at Doranginza. Workers who have recovered also spread a message of hope, saying it's not a death sentence. They all believe keeping your spirits up is vital to recovery, and Jerusalem is a great lifter. <laughs> initiative has really good meaning behind it. Basically, all of us are healthcare workers. We got coronavirus, some mild, some more severe. Thankfully, I'm quite mild. We've survived and we just want to let the public know, like, you can survive this. Just carry on being safe, carry on wearing your mask, sanitizing, social distancing. It's about, like, learning how to to cope with the COVID and and even though we, we, we come across with this uh, disease, but we still the people that we was before. So it's part of that. And even though the people that are uh, that didn't get this disease, but uh, it's a being them to be aware of that this disease is still alive and and we still must enjoy the life that we live, even though that we have this uh, in, around us. A fun fitness program has also been introduced at the hospital. I've been doing this throughout this pro, um, um, pandemic period. So it's very key and crucial because everyone is, 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 must exercise so that they can boost their immune, immune system, so that they, they, they can have the blood flow. And then also it's very also important that they need to jog and also keep them fit. The country may be on lockdown level two, but the appeal from Sister Ngaleka and her colleagues, do not drop the ball, wear a mask, Sanitize and keep your distance. Zolani Moya, SABC News, Port Elizabeth.